Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a TNT flying machine mining. So basically what happens, you press the button and the flying machine will go across blowing up the area. This is good for if you want to make a farm or something you need to clear a really large area. You can make this go for as long as you want, you just have to move this end part. And once it comes back, you can also spin it, sit in it if you want. Like this. And this is this is manual, but you can change that. So basically, at the end, it'll stop by itself. Like this. And if you want to go again, if you want to do another layer, just press the button and it'll go. So just blowing up the area like that. So the materials you're gonna need: 18 obsidian, two stone buttons two mine carts, one detector rail, one coal stone wall, one dead coral fan, one rail, 16 redstone dust, 64 blocks of choice, three repeaters, one iron trap door, seven observers, six slime blocks, one piston, three sticky pistons, and six honey blocks. Let's get into the tutorial. So I'm just going to build over here. You want to build it quite far off the ground, maybe like 20 blocks or so, so that way you're not blowing up your, you're not blowing up the flying machine. Okay, so first you're going to want to make a U shape like this, go three blocks out like this, and then out like that. So this will make this part here. Then you're going to go in and then out like that. So in, and then out like so, putting your trapdoor there. That's all you need for your trapdoor. Then with your 16 um, redstone, you're going to want to put redstone line like this. Then you want to put a repeater just on default state, and put redstone like that. Then you're going to want to build out here a bit, and you're going to put an observer with the output facing here. Then you're going to want to put an observer, you're going to put, put some temporary blocks here, and you're going to put another observer with the output facing there, and you're going to put an observer, either temporary by the way. You want to observe with the output facing there with one redstone dust on top. Then you want to grab your two buttons, put one there and one there. Okay, now you can just build the platform to stand on. You can build this out wherever you want. Okay, so now we're going to build the actual flying machine. Well, first we're gonna yeah we're gonna build this basic flying machine, which is what I showed in the tutorial. So you're gonna want to put an observer facing like that, then a piston, then two honey blocks, and repeat that the other way: observer, piston, two honey blocks, and then what you're gonna do? Is just put the minecart here. This is just for you to sit on. So just get this. And because they're honey blocks, um, it the entities stick to it, so that's why you can do this. So you're going to put up there, and break the rail, break that block, and that's there, and you can see that. So now we're going to want to build the TNT duplicator. So we're going to want you're going to put the TNT duplicator connected to here, like this. Then you're going to put an observer like that, connected to a sticky piston. And then you're going to want to put the actual TNT duplicator. This is how you make one. So you want to put two sort of L shapes like that. You want to put a cold stone wall. 
like that. Detect a rail like this with a minecart on top. And now you've used all your minecarts and all your walls and your detect rails and all these. Now you want the dead coral fan like that. And actually, I've got one TNT. And you're going to need one TNT like that. Oh, I think that's that's good. Now you just need something to activate it. So this is the TNT duplicator, as you can see. There we go. So now the main part of this is done. Now you have to make the receiving platform. So you're gonna wanna you'd wanna calculate but I'm just since I am creative mode, I'm just gonna go like this. So you're gonna do it to how far you want it to go. So you want it to go to about here. Then you just place obsidian like that. Wait for it to finish. Then you're gonna put, take your last observer. Put it there. Then you wanna put a line here. Like this, and it's just gonna curve around like so. So that's it's like this. So now what you're gonna do just put a piston like that. Use the last of your redstone like this and then you have to put two repeaters on for four ticks like so you just want to grab a button just for this time you don't usually need it and now it should head back so this is your TNT thing done so if you want to use it, press that button, it'll go, like this, you can see in the minecart if you want to, reach the end, the observer will detect it, activate this piston which activates this observer here, and then send it back. Well, thank you so much for watching this tutorial. Um, if you have any suggestions for tutorials you want me to make in the future, comment down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.